Hello, my beautiful people. How are you doing this beautiful afternoon? It's a nice day. day. It's a free fight fall. We have the nice, beautiful leaves falling at this present time. But anyway, I would like for you guys to go on ahead and to subscribe. Okay, hit that top notification bell so you don't miss any of my content. Also, share this video. Okay, so today we all know that you know how to make tuna. But that's what I had a taste for, tuna fish. So I'm going to be having tuna fish today, and that's what we're going to be doing. This is my favorite tuna. I don't know how to pronounce it, but but I, but I pronounce it as albacore. Okay, that's all I buy. I don't buy that other stuff with the water. So this is what we're going to be eating on today. Let's get started. Also, guys, I have my little drink here, my little Mike and Ike's. It's cranberry. You have to try it. It is delish. Trust in what I tell you. It's the bomb. It's bomb. You hear me? It's bomb. I'm sipping on it as we speak. Okay. So let me get this open. As simple as that. That's how that goes. Then you know any juice, just pour it out. Like that. Okay. That's how that goes. Let me get me a little bowl. Okay, okay, okay. Whoa. That's the well, you know guys, you know I don't have much space in my kitchen. But anyway, I got it all out. And whatever you can not get, just rinse that out. So your garbage don't be smelling like tuna. Wash your hands. We'll go to the second one. Okay, so I have my tuna, as you can see, in my bowl. This is what I'm going to be using in my tuna. Uh, I have my eggs and I have my onions, so I'm going to be putting that in. You can chop your onions and eggs as you like. To your pleasure okay also i'm going to be using helmets mayo this is the only thing i use in my tuna as well as my in my uh potato salad helmets i don't use no uh miracle whip and, and no sandwich spread i use helmets mayo okay three Spoonfuls. See how that go? Like that. And then I go in with my sweet relish. Okay. That's how that go. Just like that there. 
It's pretty much making potato salad. The difference is, is that you don't have your celery and stuff of that nature. But this is going to be some good tuna. I'm breaking it up now. I'm folding it like that there. Y'all see what I'm doing? Making sure that it's all mixed up together. This is some good old tuna. You understand what I'm saying? This is that good tuna. It's not cheap neither. Very pricey. But I get it on sale. You could get four big cans for, I, I believe, like $6, which is not bad at all if you're a tuna eater. Okay. And there's something else that I do. If I do take a little pepper, I don't put any seasoning on my tuna. I see people put onions on it, butter, powder, all that other stuff. I don't do that. Pepper. Okay. I don't put salt. Don't need salt on tuna. Tuna basically has its own flavor. Yeah. You can make it like you want. If you want it wet, you can make it wet. If you want it dry, you can make it dry. Me, I like mine's in between. So it don't look like enough mayo. So I will be adding more mayo. I think that would be enough right there. Yeah, this is enough. So here you have it. Big Rob's uh, uh Big Rob's tuna fish. I put a little paprika on top just to make it look good. It's a nice um look, not a flavor, a nice look. So guys, don't forget, you can follow me. You can follow me on my platforms. You can look on my description, under my description box, and follow me under all my platforms. I do my TikTok, I do my thing over there, and I do my thing on Instagram. So I would like to thank each and every one that has taken their time out today, okay, to watch this video. Know that I love you, and God love you too. Peace.